whereby actually the people from Bidayu people, they come here, they cross over. They can go to Musi, Rosengai, and cross over, okay, to, to Singawan. So there is an interaction. Uh, but this river doesn't stop them from interacting, even intermarrying, uh, and also doing business and so on. So that's why you see Simbu. This Rembu and Singai are very close together. They are opposite each other. Just now from Singawan point of view, now from this point of view is the same. Yeah? So the geography actually link them together. That's why there's a lingua franca among them. They call them Jagoi Singai uh, dialect eh, of the Pitayus. So this is significant. Uh, they link them together. Even up to today, they, they actually uh, have a more common language. Uh, then the Bidayu counterparts in, in Syrian or Padawan or even Bukat Sadong in, in somewhere in Sadong. So whatever it is, we must remember this. The place is significant in many, many ways. Okay, people coming here. Now there is one incident happened in 1857. Okay, The Chinese uh, freedom fighters led by Liu Sambang and Wang Jia. Wang Jia is another one, always forgotten and sung hero in that sense but you can see that when they were they were trying to come came against James Blue at the time because James Blue is trying to tax them try to oppress them to a certain extent even but Bidayu was also oppressed so in a way they were oppressed but then the problem is that they fight back huh? you just remember when we just now we went to the gold place in there there was a boom in gold uh, extraction. Uh. You know, Chinese are, are sojourners. They actually come here, they stay, or if they don't stay, they will go back to China before they pass away. And many a times they send back money to, to China, you know, to, so that, uh, so that uh, they eventually they still regard Chinese as uh, China as their home, uh, homeland. But now it's totally different. The third generation, fourth generation, fifth generation, they are feeling at home. They never know about what is China, what is China, you know, that kind of thing. But then the important thing now is that the, there was an incident in 1867 whereby the Chinese miners, workers, uh, from actually from Kongsi House, that's how we, we went there, uh, in the Bao Town there. We, they, they actually walked down here, uh, walked down here, some come by boats, uh, come here, and there is a group of them, Chinese here, had boats here, so lining up here, lining up boats here. So midnight, 1875, I think 18, 19 February, 18 of February, 1875, they meet here. Once they meet here, the aim is to go down to Kuching to attack uh, James Blow, the resident. So they did that, they went down, after certain Chinese ceremonies, okay, they went down, and then they, they actually took the resident, uh, Atana, for three days. No? But they after that they came back. The, but the, they have lost. They have uh, James Blue and Charles Blue, plus the mercenaries, uh, the people that supported the Blue, fought back. When they fought back, especially Charles Blue and, and the Linga group, uh, they came fought back. The Chinese, many parish died along the way, you know, from Singawan just now, or, or across this one, they, they, they walked. Uh, walk across this one to Bau along the way they were ambushed they were killed and then <laughs> some of them went as far as uh, the Pringles Bumbang there uh, a lot of them perished also uh, women children all died when they go to Samba uh, cross the cross the border they they will become they become refugees in Samanga so they the all in all there are about around two thousand people Chinese parish. So this is where is the starting point, see? <laughs> this is the starting point of Pandong, the starting point where they launched the fight. Yeah, decided. Uh, the, but the Kong Si Hao is right there. They have made decision to go. See? So they, some people just know what is happening in James Road uh, residence in, in, uh, uh, in uh, or that, that time already called Asana. You, they forgot about this area, how they launch it. Uh, you can see that it's because of the geography, because of the... Uh, they can go down, uh, if the tide comes, they can go very swiftly, go down. 
and they come back, they can use board also or by land routes. Uh. But all the motivation is about money, lah, you know, human resources of gold, taxation from the bird nest and so on. Uh. All this uh, give rise to human conflicts. Uh. So um, how we how we run the uh, resources in Bau uh, or any place uh, at all must be carefully thought of so that we can minimize or or eliminate you know, human conflicts, uh, human conflicts. So this is Dundong, a Tuesday of family place, you can see come here, but it's getting less and less uh, known, and this tree has uh, been, uh, been uh, sunken for a little bit. Uh. Mm -hmm. So good.